So it's a Sunday today and I have a couple of homework to complete. Yeah. Hello wonderful friends. Hope you're having a great day wherever you are. I thought it would be fun to take you with me in a normal study week in my life. School is no longer in line in Singapore if you didn't know and my exams are arriving so here's how my life has been. I believe that nobody is perfect and I don't study every single day. I hope this video can bring you some motivation in your life but please don't compare yourself with me. I hope you know that comparison is a thief of joy so let's just cheer each other on. Lately, I've been feeling kind of stressed but also unmotivated at the same time. Well, saying I'm unmotivated would be a huge understatement but I just feel really gross. But filming this video really pushed me to get things done and I just can't wait for event season to be over to create more content here. Since you're probably here for some form of motivation to study or work, I'll be sharing some simple but important study tips throughout the video. Firstly, I think it's really important for us to take ample breaks in between our study sessions. Especially during exam season, we just kind of forget to take care of our mental health. It's kind of cliche but I've been using the Pomodoro technique where I study for 25 minutes and then take a break for 5 minutes. This ensures I have ample time to rest, stretch, go to the washroom, hydrate, and breathe. The gravity on Earth works all the time, and so do I. So I'll find my way to the edge for some perspective on the universe. Did you know? A supernova only glows after it explodes. That's a fact I hold on to when panic attacks. Mm -hmm. Cause I don't want to spread too thin. Back to keep too many friends I give myself the space that I need And leave the atmosphere to finally breathe If you realize in the whole video, I've been eating fairly healthily and also been exercising too. I find that maintaining a healthy lifestyle is really important even during exam season. So please find some time in your day to squeeze in a workout and eat some home oh, foods. Oh my god. Down in the kitchen, really, really watching TV. You were the music that led me to the sixth string. Now it's been so long since I've heard you sing. I looked up to you, brother. 
Even when Just you do it. lost I your way In the madness of New York City Oh, you found her And now I know there's hope for me Oh my god. I'm studying geography here and there's like a lot of content to memorize so how I memorize it is that I will read it out loud and try to repeat it to myself again. I'll do this a couple of times till I'm kind of familiar with the content and then attempt to write it out. I think that writing is really helpful when it comes to memorizing things as in exam conditions I'll be writing and not speaking so yeah I hope this helps. Friday, I've been alternating between studying history and geography quite a bit. This is to facilitate active recall and space repetition. When I take a break from the subject and go back to it after a while, I'm able to test my ability to retrieve what I've memorized before and it really helps. Producing a mid oceanic ridge and forming a mid oceanic ridge, rows of submarine mountains. I'm so so sorry that you have to sit through that. Like, I take really long to memorize stuff, and it just sounds really confused. If you haven't realized already, I've been using this app called Notion to write notes and study so it's really helpful and I really recommend it. this video and have a lovely day ahead. Bye!